Well, before we go, we want to tell you about a very cool annual event coming right here to Waco, especially if you like camping and live music. I think this is the perfect combination, all right? You might have heard of Camp Fimfo. I think I said that you right. Did. But yeah. if you haven't, I have Brian Crownover. He is the assistant director for the event, um, and he's here to tell us all about it. Let us know. So yeah, it is FIMFO. Well done. Okay, um, perfect. It does stand uh, for fun is more fun outside. It is. Uh, so these concerts we put on, we did one last year. Uh, we're doing one April 26th and 27th, uh, and then one in September or early October as well. Okay. Um, they are outside. Uh, it's, a, it's a festival feel, but uh, we like to keep it uh, family-oriented. Um, it's just kind of a fun time to get out. If you like country music and have yes. fun, um, you can come out, rent an RV site, um, rent a cabin, just have a good time. And, um, you know, it's just kind of a good family feel uh, atmosphere, and it's, it's going to be fun. Yes, um, and we need that, right? Yeah. Um, so you said country music. Tell me a little bit about the artists sure. coming for this year. So Friday night, um, we have three really good artists. Uh, it's going to be opened by Roger Kreger, Casey Donahue, mm -hmm. uh, and then the Randy Rogers Band. Uh, and then uh, Little Texas, we go a little old school the next day, David Lee Murphy and Joe Nichols. Um, it's been uh, very well received and it's just, uh, again, um, outdoor festivals in the spring are always fun uh, and it's gonna, be, uh, it's gonna be an enjoyable time. And I think we have some video, if I'm not mistaken, of um, past events yep. in the area. Like you said, I see a lot of people there, very family friendly, which is always good for, you know, um, adults to get their kids together and come out. And it's pretty much, is it an all day type of event? It is, yeah, it goes from about five to 11. Uh, but on Thursday, the day before, we do have a local flair. Uh, we have 10 um, kind of a far farmer's market vendors there. We'll have oh. some local live music. We're going to smoke some briskets. Uh, we do have a lot of people that come in from out of town. Um, so we like to get that Texas feel before the actual show starts Friday and Saturday. Uh, people will enjoy the swim up bar in our pool. And then, of course, we have uh, all of our um, uh, you know, putt putt and all that good stuff for the kids, jumping pillow and all our courts and stuff so they can play before the show. That uh, and then kind of gather in the actual yeah. concert. And there's seating where you can pull your chairs up and kids can play in the back or you can just buy GA tickets and come enjoy it and have a good time. All right, so tell me a little bit about ticket information. How much is a ticket to get into, I mean, this sounds amazy. Yeah, so you can get uh, day-to-day day uh, day -day tickets, so like Friday or Saturday, or you can combine them. Uh, VIP tickets for both, I think, start at $69. Uh, what we really want to push is people to come to the park and stay. Mm -hmm. um, when you do that, you get access to the entire park, um, plus the concert, so it's really a good kind of all-in-one package. Uh, that you can enjoy and, and we've had a lot of uh, people from out of town uh, but now we're getting a lot of influx of, of locals that want to come yeah. enjoy the day hang out and then see a really fun show that night all right well hopefully you're inspired to get out buy those tickets again we'll have all this information over on our website brian thank you so much for yeah. joining us yes, and tell us about this